Yo guys, what's up? Um, I, so obviously here I'm using Shadow, um, as you can see. And now on Shadow, if I was to go to speed test, you can see the the download speed once it starts. is a gigasecond so this is the speed that you can see that uh, the download speed is now when I go and I start the download here it's downloading at zero and then it will jump up to like kilobits per second um, which is not very good so what you do is you pause it go to settings set this to 300 kilobits per second and resume You'll see that it's now downloaded at 300 kilobits per second. Then what you do is you go to settings, you scroll down, you set this to zero, and then after, I want to say maybe a minute or so, you'll see it's a jump up to download faster than what it was downloading before. It, it depends on your internet connection. So I'll see on Shadow I'm getting um, a gig a second. So realistically it should download at around 900 megabytes per second that's what um blizzard normally download at um but obviously they think they're having a server overload or something like that because there's more people online and stuff like that so the servers can't handle these the download speeds um and that's why they've they've, they've got this uh, notification here but obviously you can see now that it's starting to boost up um Obviously, it's going to take a minute before it actually starts to boost up to your actual full speed. But when I did it um, a couple of minutes ago, it went up to around 250 megabytes a second, which is still not the fastest, but it is dramatically more than what kilobytes per second is and stuff like that. But obviously, it takes a minute for it to, to kick up them speeds. Um, but obviously you can see here that it is, it, obviously if you look at task manager you can see that it is trying to boost up them speeds um, but I think the, the servers are having problems pushing out them speeds I think we just need to upgrade their internet on the, on the server side but obviously you'll see um, after a few minutes because I've just seen a video on it but it was it was in a foreign language I couldn't understand it so I was just kind of following on screen so that's why I'm doing this video um, to show people that, that it works and it obviously in an English speaking language so a lot of people can, can follow instructions easily and stuff like that. But as you can see now at least it's downloading, it's not downloading a, a gig a second but it's downloading faster than what it was um, before. So see it'll take a minute to, to boost up those speeds. Other people have also tried going here and changing um, the region, but I tried that and for me that didn't work. Um, but yeah, this this is uh, this is the workaround to to get it downloading uh, faster. Obviously, I've been recording for like three minutes now, um, and it's still not booted up. So it could take it could take ten minutes. It it it, it all depends on how the servers. Um, I gonna I gonna work for you, um, but yeah, uh, if you just give it some time and eventually it'll boost up. Um, I I didn't notice it was first. I was on uh, YouTube and I was watching a YouTube video. Come back to check the download and realised it was it was over halfway done, and then I decided to make this video to show people that that it works and stuff like that. But I've only been downloading it for about I want to say twenty minutes. Um, and obviously I've only got a gig left out of the 15 um, gigabytes what the PC version is but yeah that's my video guys and um, if it worked for you uh, then give it a thumbs up um, and yeah leave me a comment and tell me how long it took uh, for you to download it and tell me if it was faster doing this method versus allowing it to just to download at zero bytes per second because <laughs> I can imagine that a lot of people want to play season 3 on PC and it's not downloading um, and was probably had the same scenario as me um, but yeah here's a, here's a little thing for you to do and peace out guys